So what's up guys, I'm here working on a uh, work order and uh, we're going to work on a clogged toilet, I'm sorry not clogged toilet, clogged tub and we're going to check out a dishwasher uh, to see if it's, you know, doing its thing properly. Alright, we got a clogged toilet here, or I <laughs> keep calling it a toilet, <laughs> tub. And then we'll go downstairs and check out the dishwasher. Let's get to it. All right, here we go. We got the tub nice and clear. Took a while to uh, get that clog out, but I'm assuming it was a very large hairball. Uh, right now I'm just filling up the tub and then we're gonna do a drain just to make sure uh, everything's draining properly. All right, my shuffle sold. Got some water in there. I'm gonna go ahead and test the drain. Sound like we got a nice flow going on. Yup, that's what you want to hear. Look, especially when you get that flowing, you know you got a, a nice clear drain. All right, so we got a dishwasher here and the work order says it's not working properly. So uh, I'm just gonna look over a couple things inside and uh, we're gonna put it through a cycle, get things running. So part of what I think might be the issue, when I read the work order, it said not working properly. I could see this being an issue if the wheels aren't on here, and then it's also stopping the blade, or the, let me see, the, uh, I forget what you call that, but that puts out the, the jets of water and spins. I can spin when this is on top of it. So it's, it's gonna touch that and not allow that to move freely. Let me see. Yeah, that's gonna, it's gonna get stuck. See, so, let's see if we can get a new uh, rack here. All right, looking inside here. Okay, so I opened it up. Uh, we got a bunch of trash and things down in there. Uh, doesn't look like much else. I'm gonna take a closer look and then close it back up. Clean this up though first, gotta clean this stuff up. <laughs> So basically, I'm gonna set the dryer to short wash and just look over the machine while it's running through its cycle and check all the, the hoses and things like that. So here we go. As you can see, I took the plate off here just to check for any leaks. Then we got a little corrosion there. So I just stopped the wash for a second to show you something. I'm missing a rubber piece here in the corner that keeps the water from leaking out. And that's causing a uh, bit of an issue down here. So uh, I got the guys bringing up necessary rack and pieces uh, for this. And uh, we're going to get it fixed and get up out of here.